turn into a good manager of this offense. Takes the jet sweep and throws the wide receiver screen to Ladarius Eckwood. The offense. Two plays and two throws. Nature. NFL scouts are grueling at his upside potential. First run play of the day. Justin Billings with a gaping hole behind him. His balance spread attack, their second in the SWAC in running the football. Anders seventh in the SWAC, giving up more than 380 yards of contacts. On third and 12, he sails the to work with Dennis Jenkins to his left. And this is Jenkins getting the corner. Trying to get a cut block out front for that. Watch the ability. Look how nimble he is on his feet at 300 pounds, getting in there and taking the linebacker strong safety for a ride right there. I mean, you just don't find guys that big that can move that quickly. That's why he's an NFL player. Look at these quad receivers stacked up to the near side. And Anderson's going to take off. Jerry Rice. Okay. He would line up Rice at number two, number three, number four. Billings on offense on them, so get that out of the way. They've been pretty good. They screen against Presser and have space as a result. It's all Pondla. So first and ten inside the 30. Dennis Jenkins with a first down. As a head coach, you won't throw the ball every play. They fit to the ground. Anderson pressed tonight. They hand it off to Michael Wilson. Got to the second effort. They stopped him three times inside the 10-yard line. Wilson again stood up. Out of the old T formation on third down and goal. And they hand it off to Billings over the left side. He's in for the touchdown. And Pine Bluff back to work. Justin Billings who kept the last drive for the touchdown. Billings again. Got the edge sealed. And got a block in front from the at a high level right now. Third consecutive carry for Billings. This one goes nowhere. He can play above his sophomore demeanor. They're excited. On the drag. So here on the crossing route here. Good job by winners of using the official. <laughs> Use him as raise for Redshirt sophomore. And I can see the case. I mean, we've got two of the best quarterbacks in the SWAC playing this football game between Jenkins. And the Rutgers will be that what else? Empty set. Five man protects and picks oh, it. You don't need him. Edmonds leads the way for Wilson. Situation. They can play power football without a fullback. First down handoff to John Tony, who one of those staples of what Dooley likes to do offensively. Anderson chased. Empty set on third down and eight. They twist up front. Deep drop from Anderson. Retreats and spins out of it and throws deep for Ladarius Eckwood. Pass it. Get the first down. Six penalty already on Alabama State. Second one to keep this drive alive. He's earning the paycheck right now. Take a look at him playing this left tackle position. Watch him pull down the line and get a wipeout block here in the hole to spring the running back. But look how quickly he goes across formation. That's a big man, light on his feet, running like a tight end slash wide receiver. I mean, 320 pounds getting in the hole. Wow. That's tough for Brandon Roberts, the middle linebacker, to know you've got that much mass moving that fast towards you. What is that, EMC, whatever those equations are? I'm betting on him to win that battle. He's the type of package that they're looking for in the NFL. 12 play of a drive extended by a pair of penalties. On second down. Anderson for the face third and seven. Anderson with a short drop and a strong throw to it. And it hasn't seen the distraction for him on the football field. Pardon me, the penalties. This is the team that has the talent to blow people off the football field. Well, Grony, this is dangerous when they've got three receivers to one side in the middle of the field wide open. Quarterback draw, can't dance a five-man box for Alabama State with six blockers for Arkansas Pine Bluff. Justin Billings trying to take it. And from the 32, they hand it straight ahead for Billings. This is effective. Once again, they've got the numbers to run if the quarterback wants to take off. Hornets twist up front. And then he's going to get an additional five yards deep on the drop if they decide to drop back and pass. Anderson for the... I like that. I mean, that's what you have to have. It's very difficult to be a college athlete. Like, we all know that. But we do have Bluff's offense with more than 200 yards, but just one score. Down the seam. The most in Alabama State history and the active FCS leader. 
Anderson looks down the side. You've got to run the ball right now if you're Arkansas Pondo. They do with Dennis Jenkins. He's watching tape of these guys. Third down and seven. Anderson. Step into your throw. It's been Anderson getting the power play. Draw play for Dennis Jenkins on first down. Trying to stop play. He wants justification. What a run by Dennis Jenkins. The worst in the country. On third down and 13 against a four man rush. Anderson throwing B. So they empty it out on fourth down and two. Anderson throws and it's one. Grambling can do a lot of things and they've been able to run the football for years. A surge from the deep. And TQ Mims, the backup quarterback, into the game, running behind John Tony. Alabama State with a straight four man rush. Anderson pressure gets rid of it, but it's. Golden Lions back to work with a speed option play on first down for Justin Billings. New exchange of penalties. Billings gets a kick out block. Yeah, when you try and run these stretch plays here, this is McKinney here. Let's see where the hold is. It's his job to seal the edge. Yeah, I mean, you get that. It's third and four. They throw this. Jenkins are running back on first down. Cuts it back on the stretch play. Breaks out of the tackle. Third quarter clock winding down. You need to run a play. It's Justin Billings hesitating and bursting, and Billings breaks through. They'll get it off. Boy, a high toss from Jenkins to Corral. And cuts back against the. Out of the I formation on third and short, Jenkins twice today. Work out of the pistol on a counter play. Two high safeties for Alabama State on third down and 13. They go underneath, trying to run that clock even lower. Alabama State, six men at the line of scrimmage on first down, and Daniel Jenkins finds the most flat championships. They just, uh, they've got to get there. More than 250 rushing yards tonight. Jenkins fumbled the ball, but on top of it. Four-man pressure. They throw the screen to Eckwood. He won't get.